woman back to uh, a town, and after she hugs me as a thank you, she's gonna run away. Like, she's gonna run away screaming like she's trying to run, like she's trying to get away from something. It's weird. Let me see if that glitch applies. Gracias, cariño. <laughs> De nada. Is that her husband? He was weighing there. Yeah, look at that. She's screaming and run away like you're back in civilization. Why are you screaming and running away? There's nothing to be afraid about. Maybe she's claustrophobic or something. I don't know. What else is there left to do? I know. I think I'll have maybe... Get out of my way. Dang it. How can I have another drink? Is he still response? Is he responsive at all? I guess I can't get a drink now. Well, I'll have to figure this out. I know what the problem was. I didn't take off my bandana. I thought I always had it on. I've had it on since I, I, I abducted Herbert Moon. Yeah, I'll have a drink. In fact, you know what? We're gonna do a, we're, I'm gonna do our trophy for today, but first I'm gonna get drunk. <laughs> In the game, of course. There we go. I forgot what we got. We got tequila, you know. We got one round. Uh, chug it down. There's nothing like that. Okay, keep, keep them coming. What is there to say about? <laughs> what else is there to say about, actually? I can't think about anything. As far as I know, I have, like, a, nearly a half hour of filler left. I could probably do all of this in one other video file. Yeah. I wonder, actually, next year, I've seen L.A. Noir by Rockstar, and I wonder if this is actually going to be another uh, good, uh, if that's going to be a good game, but I don't know if L.A. Noir is going to be better than Red Dead Redemption or not. As you can see now, yeah, I'm losing my balance. Let's get another drink. Yeah, yeah. I barely saw any, I barely saw any tequila from that. Uh-oh. I think I'm drunk now. Yeah, there I am. Yeah, I'm wasted. I'm totally wasted in the game. Yeah, as you can see, it's like Grand Theft Auto 4, except it doesn't last as long. Get out of my way. Ah! Sorry, madam. Sorry that I ended up, you know. Okay, I can't even keep my balance. Ow. Ugh, look at this, I can't even move, like, and nobody's looking at me, why is nobody looking at me like I'm, like, I'm drunk, like, what is, the, like, why is everybody, anybody going, what the heck is this guy doing, it's like, no, they're still playing their game of poker, how about an anybody ask me if they're okay, Ugh, man, I'm so wasted, okay. come on, actually, since it's night, I can't, um, since it's night, we can't do our trophy, so I think I'm just gonna get a bounty, Come on, get your, get, get your tush over to the, to the station. Don't fall, don't fall. Ugh. God, typical, typical, ugh. What more do you expect from a cowboy in the Wild West? Uh, I think I'm gonna get the same bounty over and over again. Yeah, it's unknown. Mexican banditos, assault, a plata grande, ten dollars alive, eighty dead. In fact, I want to try something different. I want to see that instead of just capturing him immediately, I'm going to put a throwing... I'm going to put a throwing knife into his, uh... I'm going to put a throwing knife into his leg, and then after that, uh, I want to see... What the heck? Oh, before... Yeah, I want to... Actually, I haven't done a duel since episode two. Let's see. Who am I fighting this time? Who dares to challenge the Marstons? You think you can shoot, do you? Why don't yeah, you I do. Okay, fine. Let's do it. Come on, man. The location's there. <laughs> I moonwalked again for a sec. My horse bear, bear gal the way. I think I'm gonna do this the other way. I think I'm, I'm gonna wait till time is over and then I'm gonna shoot him. Well, I'm not gonna wait till time is over, but he'll draw first and I'll draw later. So then um, I'll have more accuracy. Last time I just drew my gun early, but this time I'm gonna draw it later. Okay, there we go. He's getting it. He's getting, I think, six times. Power, I'm the kisser. Yeah, there he goes. Again, does he have any money on him? Okay, he's got nothing. Okay, well, let's go get this bounty. 
Uh, it's again, it's weird. Look, he's unknown, but yet when I go across the skull, he's still, uh, he's still, he's recognized. He's Sergio Abelda. So let's. So yeah, let's go to him. We have a priest that could be beautiful at night. Yeah. I think Red Dead Redemption, without a doubt, so far is the best. As far as I've played the best free-roaming game out there. And there are a lot of good free-roaming games. There's Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, there's Grand Theft Auto 4, Grand Theft Auto Vice City, Grand Theft Auto 3, there's also No More Heroes, No More Heroes 2, uh, what, I think Dead, um, I've heard this game called Dead Space, I don't know a lot about Dead Space, but I think that's a free-roamer. I think I'll look up gameplay footage of it, but Red Dead Redemption, they're just, there's just so much more to do. I can't actually believe that Rockstar made a game that topped their Grand Theft Auto series. It's not possible. And I can't wait for L.A. Noir to amaze me, too. So we're going by... Going by the white sand. Come on! the desert. There's the gang hideout. I could add more filler, but I'm not. So running through the desert... Social club challenge. Okay, there he is. Well, I'm already here. I'm done. It usually takes me like. You're done? Uh, uh oh, I went there too early. I might as well just go after them. I'll use. I'll, I'll use the vault. The. The vault. Did I read that right? The volcanic pistol. What's so volcanic about it? I don't know, I'm just mumbling to myself now. You're making a mistake, Boy Grande. Sergio. Oh. And look, even even my player knows how to recognize the bounty, but the authorities don't. Okay, you're getting it. You're getting it. You're getting it too. You're getting to. You're getting it. <laughs> Got him. Get oh. Okay. Get your, time for my Springfield rifle. Okay, these bandits really aren't good with a pistol. They aren't good with that, with the gun, really. Uh, okay, there we are. No, okay, I'm gonna do that. Oh, oh. Uh oh, whoops. Oh, let me get. S oh, dang it, I almost died there. I need some medicine. Okay, let's see. I hope he doesn't die. Okay, I'm gonna put a throwing knife right in his knee. Okay, you're alright. It actually worked. Well, then again, I can't expect much. It is a throwing knife, but then again, it's in his knee. If it was in his head or his chest, I think it would be a big deal. Well, it's... What have you been eating? You've been eating. Okay, I'm gonna get him to the authority so I can collect a hundred dollars. The bounties... The ba um, the same bounty here over and over again is actually more entertaining than the same bounty over and over again. I get it. In New Austin. In New Austin, it's always this guy called Dale Chesson. He's either hanging out at Hanging Rock... <laughs> Hanging out at Hanging Rock. Anyway, he's uh, he's either hiding in Hanging Rock or he's um, in I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Let's see if I can find Dale Chesson is either um, b um, hiding in Hanging Rock or what's the other place? I think it's near Plainview. Wait, no, it's not near Plainview. He's either hanging out there or he's. It's at the same place you go to start. Will be at Brittle Brush Troll. Yeah, um, it's really not interesting. I always know what to expect, but with New Nuevo Pariso, it has more of a variety. Oh. So I'm gonna go back to Chuparosa. Noob. Oh. Why do you tell them to stop it? Of course they're not gonna stop it. Oh, there you go. You're dead. Down through the desert. Da 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 da. I'm running through the desert, carrying a bounty, carrying a bounty, while other bandits are trying to kill me and stab me at the same time. I think that, I think it's weird. When I have some when I have something planned, I really don't have that much to when I have something planned I have a lot to say, but when I'm just doing stuff as filler, I have no idea what what I can say. So maybe I should go back to doing planned stuff. And and I think it's weird. So, since the music is still playing, I should get my hundred dollars. 
They're going to jail. I just brought him over there automatically. Get extra widow. You are good work. That I am. Yeah, I get my hundred. Oh, I got 160. Uh, maybe I risk. Maybe I misread the zero. Now I think I'm gonna want to play in poker because. Maybe I can demonstrate for all of you why poker can be frustrating, because it always seems like... Oh, and here's a here's a famous glitch, look at that. Whenever you, Sometimes when you're in a poker game, look at this, look. Everybody looks... Everybody looks globby, their textures are always faded, and sometimes the table can have even disappear. I mean, as soon as I entered the game... Okay, now it's back, but did you see how they look before? They look terrible. Uh, six and four. Uh, hmm. I'll call it anyway. I'll just see if I get lucky. Uh-oh, I haven't... Uh-oh. I'm gonna fold. I have a ten. Okay, they have a four. So obviously that hand does absolutely no... That hand does absolutely nothing to be um, good. Look, if you leave them alone, they're gonna bet like crazy. Cornelius Wolf. Oh, I see... He's, a, he's from New Austin someplace. I kind of find it funny that you can kill a lot of people in this game, and yet for some reason they'll just come back to life playing poker or something. Like, you know how I killed her? I got the same thing? Uh, let's call that anyway. Okay, I forgot the technique. If everybody checks, I'll probably call. Okay, I'll call that. Oh, this is getting out of control. Okay, I want to see if everybody checks. He checks. He checks. He bets A1. No, I'm out. He folds. He folds. He re... Chico Revelous. I've never seen him anywhere aside from Escalera when he usually starts on over... I don't know. He's... The guy who just won, he usually just goes around Escalera killing authorities for no apparent reason. Maybe he's rebelling. He calls him... Okay, good. That's good. So now I have two people playing... I'll call that. I'm gonna call. Uh, Very wise, mister. Okay, I'll bet. Let me see if that gets me money. Dang it, he raised it. Well, he folded. You know, no, I'm just gonna try anyway. He's got an ace. Let me, let me raise it. Let me bet high. Ah, oh, dang it. Uh, I could try, I guess. Check. Okay, I've got pair of threes. What does he got? Okay, so are we gonna split it? I won for I won for some reason, but we both had the same hand. So why did I win? Like, shouldn't the pot be split? I don't know. Usually, um, if I continue playing poker, I'm usually gonna I don't know. If I continue playing poker, I usually um have bad luck and then I'm gonna lose all my winnings. So I'm gonna I left now and I got twelve dollars out of that. I don't know. I think in order to do with our trophy, what time is it? It's, it's like, uh, it's six hours until morning, so I think I'm gonna save my game and then I'll do our trophy. Okay, it's another beautiful morning in Nuevo Pariso, and our trophy for today is another fairly easy one. Um, I, first I recommend, if, if you're gonna buy a rare weapon this late, I would recommend completing all of the Nuevo Pariso missions if you wanna buy the rare weapon in Escalera. But, and that's how we get our trophy. It's another really easy trophy if you just complete the main storyline and have enough money. The trophy is called Exquisite Taste. It's bronze, and you must purchase a, a rare weapon from a gunsmith. Now, there is one gun, and there is uh, one gun located, one rare gun that's being sold by a gun gunsmith located in Escalera. I believe it's the Sonoff shotgun, so I'm going to mark it there. There's no uh, stagecoach in Chuparosa, sadly, so we're just going to ride over there. And what else can I, what else can I say? Yeah. The reason, also, I just want to say, I want to repeat myself. The reason why I call uh, the character I'm playing as the player is that I, it's not that I know little about the storyline. I actually got engrossed into the storyline of Red Dead Redemption, and I liked the care, and I liked all of the characters, even if they were bad guys, and even if they were total, you know, like, um, if they were absolutely good for nothing. Sometimes some of the characters I hate, um, I love to hate. But, and the main character, actually, I think the main character, John Marston, he's one of the most interesting video game characters ever made, not only by Rockstar, but in video game history. But the reason that I call, <coughs> ouch!